Hello everyone, let us discuss how to simplify this beautiful mathematical irrational expression. So why is this is beautiful mathematical expression? Because this will get simplified to a very beautiful answer. That is the value of this expression is nothing but an integer. That is the beauty of mathematics. Now let's see how to simplify this. To simplify this what I will do is I will assume this value to be a. I will assume this value to be b. Because this is cube root of 5 root 2 plus 7 is a, so I can write a cube is equal to 5 root 2 plus 7. From here I can write b cube is equal to 5 root 2 minus 7. So now how to simplify next step. So in the next time step what I will think is I know a cube and b cube. So I will try to generate a cube and b cube here. And how would I generate a cube and b cube here? I will take cube both the sides. I will do x cube, it will become a minus b whole cube. Because a minus b whole cube will generate a cube minus b cube minus 3ab a minus b. This is the formula we have applied. It will generate a cube minus b cube. We know both the values a cube b cube. We can easily find a cube minus b cube that is nothing but equal to 40. Because 5 root 2 will cancel out 7 minus of minus 7 will become 7 plus 7 40. So now to find the value of x we know this value that is 40. Next step we will find this value a multiplied by b. Now how we define this value? What you can do is you just can simplify here that is multiply just these two values. Even I can multiply a cube multiplied by b cube because that will give you a b whole cube. By that you can easily find a b. Now this kind of expression is scary quite common in mathematics. That is, these are the irrational conjugates of each other. 5 root 2 plus 7, 5 root 2 minus 7. So this is like alpha plus beta, alpha minus beta. If you will multiply these two, it will become alpha square minus beta square. And that will become 5 root 2 square minus 7 square. That is product of these two values. So this is nothing but 5 square is 25, root 2 square is 2. This will become 50. This will become 49. So 50 minus 49 is nothing but 1. So AB whole cube is 1. So you can easily find AB by taking cube root. So easily we can see that AB is nothing but 1. So this value also we know. So now to find the value of x we know this value that is A cube minus B cube. AB value we know. But what about A minus B? How is this value we are going to put here to find the value of x? But in the question if you will see A minus B is nothing but the value which we assumed equal to x. So this will form an equation in x, x cube is equal to 14 minus 3 multiplied by x. So this will become a cubic equation that is x cube plus 3x minus 14 equal to 0. Now we can easily check one of the values. How do we find the solution of cubic polynomial equation? That is what we do is we take the constant value and we take the coefficient of x cube. That is nothing but 1. So we just multiply 14 multiplied by 1 and we take its factors. We just have to check its factors as the values of x. What are the factors possible? 1, 2, 7, 14. These are the values of x which we will put and check. So if you will put the value of x equal to 2, you will see that it will satisfy this. This will become 2 cube that is 8. This will become 3 multiplied by 2 that is 6 minus 40. So we can say that it is 8 plus 6 14 minus 14 equal to 0. It means that x equal to 2 satisfy this cubic polynomial equation. That is how you simplify a cubic polynomial equation. If it is given you have to do factorize. So x equal to 2 satisfy this equation. It means x minus 2 is a factor of this equation. So this is how you simplify a polynomial cubic equation. Mostly these one of these values will be the value that will satisfy this equation either in the positive value or in the negative value either 1 to 7 40 or minus 1 minus 2 minus 7 minus 40. These are the values we will check first mostly these are the simpler values which will get satisfied if the cubic is factorizable. So next step what we will do is we will now divide this cubic polynomial by x minus 2 you can easily solve that part that will simplify to x square plus 2x plus 7. Now this is equal to 0. Now we can find easily x because if this part you will check the discriminant of this is less than 0 because b square minus 4ac 4 minus 28 that is less than 0. 
discriminant is less than zero it means there is no real value of x from this there is no real x but we have to check whether there will be real value or not by looking at the original expression if you will see this is also a real value this is also a real value so this will get simplified to a real value only so the answer must be a real number so that will not take from here so the remaining value that will be x minus 2 equal to 0 that will give you x equal to 2 see a beautiful answer can you ever imagine before starting the question that this expression will simplify to the value of 2 so that is the beauty of mathematics that is why i love mathematics and most of you watching this video love mathematics and if you are interested in more of these interesting math videos please subscribe to my youtube channel thank you so much for watching this video and i will see you in the next video